Well, most of us associate a big holiday meal with turkey, but there is another bird that could really make that meal take flight. Bradley Gilmore is the executive chef of Graham and Dunn. Okay, what are we making today? Well, no, we've, we've got jerk pheasant that came out of smoker this morning, and I'm going to make some southern fried rice to go with it. Uh, yes, please. Yeah. That sounds great. Now, what was the inspiration behind this dish, chef? A um, couple things. It's pheasant season here in Missouri, so we wanted to do some pheasant, and we have a... Jamaican who moved over and we got her in our kitchen and she had been making us Jamaican jerk wings for a while for snacks in the kitchen so we decided we'd finally put some on the menu. Jamaican me hungry, okay. Yeah, exactly. Um, southern fried rice, you gotta start with a very, very hot pan and we start with a little bacon, can't be bacon without. Everything is better with bacon, chef. Bacon and hot peppers, little ah. hot peppers there. Um, you sweat those off a little bit, get that moving around. And then black eyed peas, another thing that really. Southern, southern, very southern, yep, southern yep. chef. Get that going. We've got some tomatoes we throw in there. We just substitute southern ingredients for it. Mm -hmm. um, like I said, the key to fried rice is a hot pan. If you have a little wok at home that works very well, make it sizzle. Um, then what you want to do after that's working around, add your basmati rice. Now, what if I, let's crazy talk, what if I want to throw in brown rice on my life? Brown to? rice, absolutely. Rice absolutely. is rice. Rice, right. rice is rice. Brown rice is great. My wife makes me eat brown rice at home, so. There you go. White rice at work. Good and good for you. Um, southern sauce, we take Soy sauce, oyster sauce, and Worcestershire. 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 Yes, Worcestershire. Sir. That's what gives it its real southern. Now, if you want to make, if you want to make pheasant at home, do you have any cooking tips? I mean, is it basically like preparing a it chicken is, or anything It is else? like chicken. Just don't overcook it. It will get dry and it okay. will get hard. Um, we use an airline breast that we uh, marinate for 24 hours and then we smoke it. Okay. Um, so we don't serve the thigh and the leg because it gets really dry. A um, little bit of egg to finish that off. And I prepared this morning. Wow. Yeah. Look at how this came together in like two minutes. Yeah, it's southern fried rice. Super easy. As long I as you have it. all your mise en place ready. Your who's he what? Mise en place. Mise en place. Uh, mise en place. Okay. All your ingredients. You learn something new every day. Every day. Right. It's French. Wee oui, wee. Um, oui. Wee oui, wee. Oui. There we go. Southern fried rice. Nice now, and chunky. Now, is and this delicious. on? Is this a new menu item? This is a new menu item. We've got a bunch of new menu items going on right now. New appetizers, beef. What and else a did you bring us? Are you, uh, it's it's old home week. It is beef in a blanket. Uh, I grew up eating pigs in a blanket, so we had a little ketchup, mustard, and homemade bread and butter pickles there. New house made sausage. Um, we've also got burning mac and cheese. Oh, hello. Buffalo, yeah, burning mac and, and cheese. And I noticed yeah. this was bone marrow. I'm not bone I, marrow goes with the bread real well. I'll try this. I'll try. I'll give it to you. Like I'll it. try like it. All right. Yes. And then I just topped that off with a little Texas Pete gastrique, which is a hot sauce with sweet and sour. So you got your southern hot sauce, a little sugar, a little uh, vinegar in there. Uh, while, while I dig in, which I'm going to try right now, you have a big wild game and whiskey dinner coming up. Tell coming us up, about that. Uh, November 19th, we paired it with five different whiskeys and five different game animals. We've got some wild goat cheese, elk from different regions. Um, oh, that's good. Yeah, very nice. Wow. And what's going on for Thanksgiving? Thanksgiving, uh, family style dinner um, all day, starting at 11 a.m. And we've got boar leg, roasted turkey, shaved ham, Brussels sprouts. And then we have a limited dinner menu as well. I love it. All right. Well, Graham and Dunn's Thanksgiving Dunn Family Style. Get it? Dunn Family Style will be all day on Thanksgiving. It's $30 for adults and $12 for kids under 12. Chef, you have outdone yourself. I cannot wait to dig into all of it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Let's throw things over to Michelle.